Alrighty, guys, let me just get over this picture. Can you see me there? Hello. Doing another little introduction video, I guess. I'll try to do a little recording. Uh, it's a Lana artist. Uh, this is something I drew earlier, if you've seen that just now. Mixed meteors. Um, hi, I'm Alana. From, also known as Alana Art Dream from Instagram, Tumblr, and Twitter. Also Alana Boffin from Facebook. You see me there. Though I wouldn't recommend following me on Facebook because my dad's on there and he's a bit of a judgmental... Well, <laughs> I'm a, I, I don't live with him or anything. I sort of don't see him very often anyway. But anyway, my dad's on there and he's a bit of a judgmental widow. So <laughs> I don't want to subject anyone to his whims. So, anywho, uh -huh. um, apparently seems, I can't seem to answer some people who try to comment to my videos. Some of them don't seem to show up. I'm not sure what's going on with YouTube on that regard. So, but I want to say thank you for your comments, guys. I really do appreciate it. And the subscribes as well and, and stuff like that. I really do appreciate it. And I want to say thank you to all of you. I can't seem to do can't seem to do that very well because some of you seem to be blocked. I'm not sure what's going on on that one because I haven't blocked anyone on YouTube. Not really. So if it seems I'm not answering, it might be that YouTube's got this thing. For some reason, some people it lets you comment to and other people it does not. So I think because I've put, because sometimes I um, draw fan art for certain animes and games and do reviews and that. So I've safely put myself not for kids because some games are not kids and same with some cartoons and anime and stuff like that so hence um, my channel isn't put down for kids because I'm not sure if I don't want to get you know in trouble so if your account is put down for kids I think they kind of block you from talking to those accounts so I don't know so just a word of the wise make sure you're not set on a child safety otherwise you might not be able to interact with some of the other accounts so Unless you're a kid yourself, just, you know, YouTube's going through this whole funny thing. Anywho. So if, if I'm not replying, it's because YouTube won't let me or it's got some sort of weird guidelines. So, anywho, I'm going to do a little drawing patterns today. <laughs> As they tell you, you should practice drawing circles and patterns before you start doing sketches. And I'm going to decide to do some patterns. what I can do with this. I'm going to do some relaxing drawings of sorts. I'm going to do pattern work instead of just characters. I think we'll start off with green. Some little vines. Have some fun, play around with patterns. If it cuts out, though, I'm sorry. <laughs> Anywho, but anyway, I was saying thank you to all of all of you who are subscribing so far. We've hit 16 subscribers. I know it's not a very big number, but I think it's pretty cool. So get some pattern work into the way. Playing around with some drawing pattern ideas. Sometimes you just make some little patterns, do squiggles, make it as a practice drawing, or do it just to try and relax. It's just doodling, really. So, thank you so far for the comments and things. I do appreciate getting them, the subscribes, and all that. And I do want to say thank you to you all who are still commenting and stuff. I always appreciate it. If I can't reply, YouTube's being weird. So, 
Do not ask me why it does that, but yeah. Let's see what's in here. A while since I've just done a drawing of a pattern pattern instead of a little character. I'm also looking forward to Animal Crossing game. I'm drawing some Animal Crossing characters. If you checked out my Instagram, there's quite a few up <laughs> drawing updates of that. And at this point, I might as well just get rid of the circles. I didn't end up using them. Huh. Mostly doodling, doodling, doodling. I should have gotten those in first. Too little, too late. Try practicing like little doodles and stuff as well. They're great for relaxing, in my option anyway. If you can't think of anything to draw, why don't you try um, getting a piece of paper out and doing some doodles? You don't have to show it anyone if you don't want to, but you can practice doing little doodle pages, funny little things. Or you can do practice sketches. So, if you've got an art block, my recommendation, you get a piece of paper, a scrap piece of paper somewhere, or you get out your sketchbook and find a page you just want to doodle and scribble down some weird patterns. Who knows, maybe you can get some ideas for getting patterns for your Animal Crossing later on when it comes out, which I've heard a lot of people are getting already ideas down. So I'm just having colored pens to do practice doodle sketches on. It's fun. Let's see, here's a dry off net. Get rid of that. Mind. That looks kind of cool. I like that effect. Having colored pens is sometimes fun using just to do practice little doodles. Or you can just use a pencil and do scrap little doodles in black and white too. Is that still recording? Yep. Good, we're still recording, that's good. I swear it cut out in one of my last drawings. I was in the middle of coloring. Like, rude, I know, it was so rude. I don't like it when it cuts out in the middle of a drawing. I like it when they have different colored tones to green because then I can make the leaves show out if I put leaves on something. Hmm. My mom's always been a supporter, so I'm kind of lucky in that regard. Love my creative sides. My dad, not so much. I love him, but he's not very 
outside the box thinker, so <laughs> open minded, I mean. I mean, he can be accepted to some degree, but he has some weird opinions. Especially after he had his stroke, he's been a bit weird with his opinions. I mean, I don't live with him. He lives somewhere with his new wife, so we don't really talk much. But his new wife seems nice. I haven't really met her that much. I mean, I met her only once or twice now. It was on my sister's wedding. So, I said we don't really hang out much. Let's see. What can we draw into this to make this look a bit more? Is. We're just playing around with ID colors and such. Just having some fun. Yeah. Yeah, that doesn't show up. Not a wise decision. Let's have some fun with colors. There we go. I mostly just didn't even see where I go with this. Always to have a little bit of fun. See where the doodle goes. If you're stuck at home a lot, you can try practicing doing some doodles. See if you can make them into something, like start just scribbling around and see if you can turn it into things. It couldn't hurt to really try out, you know? Let me just do a little something here. I mean, there's some doodle books out there to give you ideas. With doodles, you don't have to plan anything. You just scribble and you see what you can come up with. Well, sometimes you have to if you want to do like a plan thing, but... If it's a rainy day and you can't think of anything, get a piece of paper out, some colored pens, and start doodling and see what you end up coming up with. Having some fun with the colored pens. Shall we?
And sometimes when you make a really nice pattern, you can give them up as Christmas cards. <laughs> Especially if you can't think of any characters to draw for someone, Goodles are sometimes make some pretty little designs out of things. I used up all my spaces. I have this. Oh no. Wait. Well, I have not. So far, it looks kind of nice. Hmm. I don't know what color I'm thinking in. Hmm, it's too close to something else, but I'm gonna try it out. Sometimes when you just can't think of what to draw, draw a pattern. Or doodle till you get something. See what your doodles end up making. Start doing little scribbles. Let's see if you can turn those scribbles into something. You might even have a random pattern. Waiting for someone or you're on the phone doing little doodles. They're also a good option. You can see what you fit in there. 
And then when you're finished, you can have a look and see if you've got a really pretty drawing. Or you want to start over with a new doodle. Especially when you have ink, you can play around with patterns when you do ink drawings. So far I'm liking this pattern I'm having right now. Let's see, what's this do? Ooh, that looks nice. Also, art's a really good way of de-stressing. You kind of need to take a break, do some little doodles. I mean, art's not easy, but if you can do some little doodles on the side, this, you know, if you can't think of anything, do some little doodling. Just to help you relax again. Are you still recording? Yep. Awesome. I can show you the finished thing once I'm done. So the pattern doodles. Let's see what other color to use. Red and used yellow. Let's see what we can do with the orange. a good impression of the colors we've got going here. I might have made it a little too busy. Oh well. Having fun. No set plan. If you want me to draw some more of these pattern doodles, those video clips, let me know and I will do them. Because they are rather relaxing for me. Because I don't have to have a set plan on doing them. I mean, they're not easy because I sort of end up going overboard. But doodling is a good thing to do if you can't think of anything to draw and you're waiting for things or... I can even fit these little ducklings. It's looking pretty. I started up with just some little squiggles. Let me get my pink just sitting where they are. Mm hmm. Looking maybe a little too busy now. <laughs> Friend once complained once when I do my pattern doodles, he didn't like how busy I made some of them look. I don't really plan out doodles. You sort of just draw them and have fun. It's a relaxing thing. And if I try to control what they're like, they probably wouldn't turn out as nicely See if I had a bit of gray in this somewhere. There we are. The 
Yeah, I'm making this a little too busy now. Whoopsies. If Animal Crossing really let me have some pens and make it a bit more interesting with the drawing. I don't know, the game hasn't come out yet. I wonder what patterns I could come up with. I mean, it don't look like it gave me that much space. And it looks like I'm on grid squares, so I'm kind of looking like I might be caged. We'll have to wait and see what I can do. I do not like being caged. I like a little freedom. To let my mind wander while I'm drawing. I do not like putting it in a box. There we are. It's looking very nice. Doodle patterns are funner for me because I don't have to set a certain rule for doodles. Whereas when you're drawing characters, there are certain rules, sadly. Like you have to really pay attention to the subject matter you're drawing, whereas doodles you can sort of just muck around. This one to mom. She gets back in. Push a little white pen. There we are. We are done. And I can wait to have a better look at it from the other angle I'm seeing it from. There is the finished product, a doodle page. Thank you for watching and uh, please do um, subscribe if you're interested in watching more of my drawings or want me to talk about certain games and cartoons and stuff like that. Um, if I don't reply, it's because YouTube's being weird and not letting me reply back, which is weird. I don't know why it's doing that. Anywho, I will try to com reply if YouTube let me. Um, it won't let me do lives yet either, so... Or at least when I'm on the iPad anyway, so. Uh, thank you for the comics so far, and those of you who have been subscribing. If you want to see all of my drawing videos, click the bell. Um, if there's a certain post you really like, please do put a like on it, so I know to do more of that. So if you like this video, and you want me to do more videos like this, please give it a thumbs up. So then I can get the idea you want more of those. So anyway, thank you for watching. And I do check out my Instagram sometimes. You can see a few of my other drawings so you can get an idea of what I do, do draw on the regulars and what I might end up talking about in the future things. I don't stick just one subject. <laughs> Thank you again.